Hey guys, I'm back with a new video today. In today's video, I'm going to be talking about why I kind of quit Diablo Immortal. If you guys have seen, I have been posting as much Diablo Immortal content uh, as I was doing before. Uh, and that's because I've not been playing the game that much. And uh, I'm going to be telling you guys why in this video and uh, what I would like to see change uh, for me to actually come back and grind the game again. Uh, so without further ado, guys, give me a uh, make sure you guys a like and make sure you guys subscribe if you guys haven't already. And uh, remember, guys, two most important things in life is one is follow your dreams and two, follow my channel. And you know what's perfect with this, guys, is when I logged on today, they told me to take a survey. So I was like, yo, this is perfect for today's subject, right? Take this survey. You guys can't. Oh, OK, the survey is no longer uh, active. Never mind. Well, that is completely fine. Now, can I claim all. Yeah, let's just claim everything now you guys know i was grinding diablo a lot with my friends and most of my friends quit i still have some friends that are still playing the game so i'm not going to completely stop making content on diablo i'll still be making some videos here and there uh and some fun um, overall videos on it but i'm not going to be playing the game like i used to and the reason for that is very simple and uh, this game was a lot of fun leveling up and grinding and starting at paragon levels and gearing up your characters, but it became super repetitive very fast. I was enjoying uh, playing this and grinding up, but what I really like about like games like this is the hard, difficult content, right? Or PvP. So I grind, like I don't mind grinding endlessly for hours to get some type of gear. Uh, but this game has its soft caps uh, that will not let you grind endlessly, and also. I like it to be rewarding right i like to be able to grind super hard for gear or combat power or whatever and then do some hard difficult content and i was really hoping that they will have that in those lasalle raids and stuff that they will add new hard content that you can do and have fun with uh but they're pretty easy most of the content in this game is pretty easy and the stuff that is difficult like uh the wars where you fight the immortals or pvp is not balanced right so somebody like me that doesn't play as much as others is going to get demolished right so i was really hoping they would have some type of uh balanced pvp or some kind of balanced immortal pvp i mean something like that along the line with, with that right but i just feel like the end game is not not that rewarding um and it's just like I'm just grinding endlessly for like no reason right and uh i don't like that in games i will uh but you know diablo is a really like grinding game so it's like i shouldn't expect much but i think the way that they did it with how they're running it as an mmo i was really hoping that there would be like content that would be like more challenging right like some maybe some guild raids that are super challenging uh that you take uh several tries to uh to Lead or some fun like overall just strategy um strategy no i'm saying strategy but just say uh, game uh like uh content that is actually difficult and fun to do right and i think they really dropped the ball with um, the pvp and the pvp not being uh fair dual uh and balance it's just it's just not enjoyable right because at the start you guys saw my video on the pvp if you guys have it i would like I will suggest you guys watch it. I was having a blast. The start of the game, when everybody was uh, equally geared around the same level, the PvP was a blast. I had a lot of fun just playing and uh, enjoying the PvP experience. Uh, but now it's kind of hard, right? I enter PvP, and since I haven't been playing much, I'm going to get demolished, right? So I really hope the things that I really want to see for this game is obviously... Obviously, I want to see uh, better rates, uh, better drop rates for uh, gems uh, to gear up your character and stuff. Stuff like that, I want to see. But uh, for me, it's not that important to, uh, how often you drop this uh, gear or legendary gear. I just hope that they remove like the cap. They have like soft caps, a lot of stuff where you can't fully grind out the game. Uh, so for hardcore grinders that just want to keep grinding, uh, you don't feel as rewarded. And... I really hope to add some fair uh, balanced pvp like i get it like you want to reward people that spend money on this game and spend um and build their characters you want to reward them be, uh, with being stronger than everybody but you guys already have the system like that you have like immortals 
you know, versus shadows. So it's already a thing in place, but why not make some kind of fair dual PvP? I mean, it doesn't hurt, right? Uh, adding some kind of PvP modes for people that want to enjoy the fair, uh, fair duel, like a class balance or gear balance one. And then people that don't want to do it, the pay to win players can go play their or other arena, right? So, you know, for, oh, I didn't, I did participate, partici I mean, I didn't participate in our last war. I think we did decent though. My guild did decent. Uh, but I also hope they have some hard content. Like this game has the ability add difficult raid like when you go here and you do your eight man lasalle raids or whatever right they add a new raid uh vital which is also pretty simple i just want them to like the further they go on the raids to actually make them difficult right where people struggle where you die we have to take several attempts there's different strategies of all because this game has the mechanics to do it there is this game is built very nicely it's very optimized and they have the ability, especially because they're working with NetEase. If you guys don't know, NetEase made the best raid MMORPG uh, on mobile. It was called Crusaders of Light. And that game had insanely good, difficult raids. They had mechanics. They had 50, 30 mechanics per boss fight. Uh, if you failed, you would get one shot and uh, you had to grind. Like It felt like an actual MMO. We had to sit in raids for hours that we used to do back in the day we used to sit in these mmos for hours uh on mobile and just wipe and grind and i want them to add some type of content like that so like it feels rewarding you're grinding all this stuff for for fun hard difficult content right hard fun balanced pp with some fun leaderboards some fun rewards and so on right now uh i talked to my friend he's grinding let me see well let me see what level he is like he is grinding this game and he's loving it right there are people that really enjoy the grind i can't see because it's offline i think he's like level 80 or something i don't know 90 you have even higher probably hard on level but i just hope that they add more like uh fun stuff and game stuff to do uh so you don't only spend time just fully grinding and you know losing your soul uh so i will be uh posting videos here and there i'm not gonna be playing it like i was uh, I did quit for like I see I haven't leveled much on my Paragon level since my last stream. Uh, but if they add some fun content, if they do add PvP, uh, balance PvP and some fun uh, raids, I don't mind grinding and leveling up if there is hard, difficult, fun content to do like end game raids and stuff. That'd be sick. So hopefully they'll add it, you know, I mean, they have a strong community and hopefully they'll listen to the community and make some cool changes to the game, you know. Uh, and uh, make it a fun experience overall. But Diablo Immortal for me is set in stone as a good uh, game on mobile uh, because it has it is very well made. Uh, I don't know, like a lot of people complain about the game overall. It's fine. It, it does you know it is pay to win and it is super grindy and it is soft capped and stuff like that. But the game overall mechanic wise is very well made. Uh, I will put it like up to like the top tier games on mobile right now and it's still very early too so we'll see what the big update was a new update in patch last week or something right where they added the new raids uh, and we did some changes to the game out of the battle pass and stuff uh, so it's pretty fairly new so we'll see where this game goes uh, uh, they usually have like a big every game like these have like a big uh, Christmas update uh, so we'll see where it is at the Christmas update and then I'll make like an updated video if it is worth getting back into or not So let me know what you guys think you guys are still playing Diablo Immortal Let me know what you guys think. Are you still enjoying the game? Are you still in love with the game? Uh, obviously you can disagree with me. You can be like hey Spid uh, I don't think so. I really enjoyed the game still because blah 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 blah, right? So let me know in the comments. I love to hear you guys' opinions of the game and are you guys still playing? Uh, and will you be still playing and if you are not still playing if you quit why did you quit why do you not enjoy diablo immortal anymore let me know i would love to hear you guys' opinions again guys thanks so much for watching give me a thumbs up and sure you guys subscribe and i'll see you guys in the next video Bye bye